Okay, here's another possible topic of conversation. This is a big night for Sheldon. Right, Sheldon? Big night? The winter solstice is a big night. It's over 14 hours in Southern California. That's an amusing factoid. Thank you. Uh, no, no, my point is, uh, tonight is Sheldon's first official date. Discuss. Is this true? Uh, apparently, a semi-incestuous Teens for Jesus 4th of July hoedown didn't count. So, um, Amy, what about you? Do you date much? Once a year. It's a deal I made with my mother in exchange for her silence on the matter as well as the occasional use of her George Foreman grill that seals in the flavor without the fat. <laughs> what about you, Penny? Do you go on many dates? Uh, yeah, I wouldn't say many. A few. <laughs> <laughs> What's... <laughs> Your characterization of approximately 171 different men is a few. What? you get 171 men? Simple extrapolation. In the three years that I've known you, you were single for two. During that time, I saw 17 different suitors. If we work backwards, correcting for observation bias and postulate an initial dating age of 15. But, whoa, wait, 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 I did not start dating at 15. I'm sorry, 16? 14. <laughs> My mistake. Now, assuming the left side of a bell curve, peaking around the present, that would bring the total up to 193 men. Plus or minus eight men. Remarkable. Did you have sexual intercourse with all of these men? No. Now, although that number would be fairly easy oh. to calculate, based on the number of awkward encounters I've had with strange men leaving her apartment in the morning, plus the number of times she's returned home wearing the same clothes she wore the night before. Okay, Sheldon, I think you've made your point. So we multiply 193 at minus 21 men before the loss of virginity. So 172 times 0.18 gives us 30.96 sexual partners. Let's round that up to 31. Okay, Sheldon, you are so wrong. That is not even close to the real number. I'm gonna need a drink over here. <laughs> this is very interesting. Cultural perceptions are subjective. Penny, to your mind, are you a slut? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> Let's just all finish our dinners, okay? This is an interesting topic. How many sexual encounters have you had? Does volunteering for a scientific experiment in which orgasm was achieved by electronically stimulating the pleasure centers of the brain count? I should think so. Then 128. 